Hi, I'm Jess. Let's get started with Video Scribe. So when you download and install the app, the first thing you'll need to do is enter the same email address and password you used when signing into the site. Once you've signed in, the first screen you'll see is the project screen. Here you can open saved projects. You can open projects that are saved online to your cloud folder, or you can start a new project. Once you start a new project, you'll see the toolbar at the top. You'll see the timeline underneath with options to the right for adding things to it. And you'll see the canvas in the middle. Let's add an image to our scribe. Video Scribe comes with a huge library of images. So you can search for what you want using the search box, or you can browse through them. You can move the image around on the canvas. You can also rotate the image, and then you can scale it. You can also add text, type your message into the text box, then choose a colour and change the font. So let's preview our scribe. As you can see, Video Scribe automatically animates anything you place on the canvas. Now I'm going to add some sound. Video Scribe lets you add a voiceover. It also comes with lots of soundtrack options. Once you're happy with your project, you can publish it. Free trial users can publish to YouTube, Facebook or a PowerPoint file. And pro users can publish to our online video sharing site, show.co, or choose from a variety of video formats to publish to their machine. And that's how easy it is to animate with VideoScribe. If you'd like to learn more, go to help.videoscribe.co. Thanks for watching.